Hey there, it's Michael Carter. Now today we're looking at using Fiverr to start your internet career. Now there's a lot of people every single year that you know they decide that they want to start their own side business or they might even want to replace their current position at their job just because they're unhappy. Now not many people actually know how to gain credibility in the field that they want to be working in and it's really important that you start gaining that. Now one of the easiest ways to get started working for yourself in any field is to try it out on Fiverr.com. Now if you're not sure whether you really want to do something or not, um, you can actually just start a gig as an experiment. Now if you set up a gig, this is what they're called on Fiverr, a gig. Um, if you set up a gig offering a service that you're interested in and it will allow you to actually test out that market without you know really putting out any money and for very little effort. Now there's no limit to the number of services that you can offer to perform on Fiverr. Now you just need to give it some thought and you don't need to end up losing any time or money um, without any kind of gain. Now before you get started with your Fiverr career you should have a solid look around Fiverr, spend some time on there and see what things actually interest you. Take the time um, you know, try doing some of the things yourself before offering them as a gig. Also, take a good look at your competition in the market. Now, if you're able to offer similar services for the same price, you might consider starting a gig to actually compete with them. Okay, it's, uh, competition is always good. This is healthy competition. Now, for some people, Fiverr has allowed them to begin an entirely new career based on skills that they started using on Fiverr. It's incredible. Now, while many business people, you know, they think they can't possibly gain anything from working on Fiverr, I assure you those people simply don't have the imagination needed to succeed as an entrepreneur on Fiverr. Now, here are some ways that Fiverr can jumpstart your life as an entrepreneur. Okay, so number one, share your goals. Now, for many people, they hide from their passion and they keep it a secret from the world. Now, if you're going to do work on Fiverr, you can't do that or you just, you're not going to get much work. Okay, so you need to share your gigs with everybody in the world in order to get your business going. Now, it's recommended that you share your dream and passion with everyone, right, so that you stick to your guns. Now, for many people, taking on a new goal, I mean, that can be a scary thing. I get that. You need to face uh, that fear and just do it anyways, guys. Okay, now working on Fiverr, um, it can help you acknowledge publicly what goals you're aiming for. Now this skill is essential for entrepreneurs to become successful because it helps them reach that next level in their business. So number two, learn communications. Now if you have ever had an issue with communication, you're going to get over it when you work on Fiverr. Um, the only means that you have to communication with your clients is through messages on Fiverr. Okay, so you're, you're really going to become an expert in how to effectively communicate in a neutral and disarming way with everybody. Okay, it's going to come, um, you know, there'll come a time through a lot of trial and error, but you will start to get the hang of it. Now, you're going to see how far people are willing to try and push your limits when you do work on Fiverr. Um, but setting limits and sticking to your guns will become, I mean, really important and you'll become a pro at negotiations. Just by responding as quickly as possible um, and be, it's just, you know, just being really polite and sincere can take you guys a long way. So number three, okay, turn fun into money. Now anytime you're going to be offering to perform a service on Fiverr for five bucks, yes, that's what Fiverr is, um, you really have to consider how much effort you're actually putting into the work. Okay, I mean you can't offer anything that is too complex or you're just simply going to lose money. Okay, that would be terrible business. Now starting a business on Fiverr, it makes you think about what service uh, could be for, uh, performed without um, a huge effort. Okay, yet it's going to add value to the customer's life. Now something that's fun to do um, that you're not going to get tired of doing. Okay, so a good choice could be digital marketing services. Now when you offer services that make you feel good to perform, it will be successful and you're going to be able to make a pretty good income from that because it will just feel like you're playing. Okay? It's not really like work. Now it's proven that when entrepreneurs perform the work that they like doing, 
they tend to make more money doing so. Okay, so number four, gaining confidence. Now, when you spend some time working on Fiverr and creating solutions for people through the work you're doing, um, you'll start to gain confidence and you, know, you need this to actually work in the field that you're offering services in. Okay, so you, you'll no longer feel as though you, know, you don't have the knowledge in your field. Um, you know, you're just going to know that you have all of a sudden a profound knowledge in that field and it's a, actually an incredible feeling. Now, if you're working for yourself outside of Fiverr as well as performing uh, services through Fiverr, um, you're going to be able to build your confidence through customers that contact you and use your services. Now, with enough practice, really, you'll become a professional at your service and solving the problems of people who request your services, um, it'll just become second nature to you. Now, the more customers that you help, the less time it takes to perform your service and the more money you can make. Okay, so we're moving on to number five. Okay, keep going. Now, in the beginning, you know, you, you're most likely going to come up against some obstacles. Okay, it's very, it's just a fact of life. Okay, um, you're going to make a few mistakes, but you can get over those and learn how to avoid them in the future. Okay, when you make these mistakes, um, you know, you have to think about, you know, why you made this mistake in the first place and then just correct it. Um, now, you just got to keep going, guys. Now, if you haven't made a mistake, you're simply learning a lesson in life. Okay, just think of it as, <clears throat> you know, if you never make a mistake, you're really not learning, guys. So um, just take it all in stride, okay? It's really not a big deal. Don't make a huge deal of any mistakes and just move on. Now, there's such a steady stream of work to be found in Fiverr. Um, I find it crazy when, you know, more people don't offer services there. Okay, when you feel down on yourself, just pick yourself up by your bootstraps and move on to the next client, okay? There's always always someone there looking for your service. Now, when you're working on Fiverr, remember that you know, you're know you as good as your word, okay? And that's how people will see you. Never leave a dispute open. Always find a resolution with a client that has any issue with your service. Um, you wanna develop a system for meeting and exceeding your client's expectation, and you're gonna be able to make a good, solid income performing your services on Fiverr. So that's about it. Thanks for watching, everybody. This is Michael Carter here, and we'll see you next time.